hello friends so today we will discuss about how to get started with maven project so we'll set up maven project uh, for selenium web driver so for maven as well we need to do uh, we need to go to help and install new software and we need to find out the server where the maven to eclipse uh, plugin package is basically there so let's do one thing let's search for maven eclipse in the Google so it will give us the uh, Eclipse site we need to go to this uh, URL m2e Eclipse that means Maven to Eclipse integration and it will have all the installation details or for instructions so we are just following it so if you read through what it is saying into your Eclipse ID or use the Eclipse marketplace client directly from within the ID there will be some other entry exists that look like m2e but they are usually outdated or incorrect please use the official one linked above so we, we should use the official link only to get the m2 eclipse that that is maven 2 eclipse integration plugin so i'm just copying this link and then we can either do add and then give name and then location and save it but uh, i'm not doing that we can directly put the url here and if we click on enter uh, it should face the maven to eclipse integration plugin okay so now it is showing me error uh, let me see again okay have i copied the correct url or let me take this actually download this so i have taken the above one i should text basically this actually for latest so let me do one thing yeah now it is uh, taking that maven to plugin integration so select all and you just need to click on next so this will start downloading so if you observe it has started downloading the packages from the server which we have provided it will take some time so i'm just waiting for it to finish okay you can directly um, download the Eclipse um, Maven uh, uh, Maven plugin or from the Apache Maven website like this and you can um, download these Apache Maven actually yeah from here and you can download the latest one so you can go to download and you can download the latest uh, maven file so what i'll do uh, let's say i have download i will download this zip file now if you got if you see we got this file and if i extract it now So there are two ways actually basically you can either do okay so here it got uh, shown me to next page so what i'll keep keep on or keep my installation the same and modify the items being installed to be complete so it basically asked when some some of the packets are already there installed so let me or update my to come with the items being installed let me choose this one and click on next okay so i'm showing two ways basically then click on next accept the license terms and click on finish so now it it will start installing the software and it if you observe in the bottom it is showing the percentage uh, where are we with the extraction okay so it is extracting I don't know why my system is being that slow So for now i'll pause my video and we'll continue again once the installation is complete just to avoid the length of the video So as we seen earlier our maven installation completed now so let's verify uh, with uh, whether it is there in preferences so if you find there is a maven setup now 
and you can also verify in the installation so embedded means that it is um, uh, embedded in Eclipse itself and we do got the uh, external Maven files as well so we can add those as well so let me add that and we will use that so I have copied that um, Apache Maven folder to here so we just need to uh, select the base folder which will have all the bin and all other folders so select the uh, file uh, Apache Maven 3.8.2 folder then uh, you need to click on finish and select this apply and apply close so then we are now referring to the uh, external Apache Maven okay so let's create new project uh, Maven project so I'll show so if you observe there is no option directly for Maven project but in the other section you will find a Maven and you can create a Maven project so let's select that Maven project and in next okay so uh, it will ask for the workspace so I'm creating these in the same by default workspace on which I'm working on now we need to uh, select the arc type so it will populate all the available arc type what is arc type basically so I already got a Google page for you ready for you so basically arc type is nothing but a template uh, uh, by default template so in short archetype is a maven project templating toolkit so that means um, it will uh, define uh, what kind of uh, project or what kind of template we want to use to create the project so that's why it is templating toolkit so you can read through more and there will be more information useful information on this project uh, I probably will copy the links uh, in the description as well so now what we need to do we need to uh, select the arc type so uh, as we are working with the uh, test ng for now uh, so what we'll do I'll select if you if you enter the selenium it will give all the uh, matching arc types for selenium it could be jbh or it could be test ng or it could be cucumber so basically uh, there will be different um, uh, template toolkit will be there with maven for to work with selenium for now what I'll do I'll select the test ng because we are going to uh, create a demo project for test ng type uh, toolkit so then you need to uh, click on next then it will ask for the artifact ID and um, group ID and artifact ID so what is group ID and artifact ID so to give you an example I just search it on the Google so group ID is nothing but a unique base name of the company or group that created the project so who is creating the project that will be the group uh, group ID and the artifact ID will be the unique name given to the project so let's do one thing let me give uh, group ID name at step by step uh, the channel for which we are creating this uh, uh, project okay and as artifact ID at what I'll do I'll give the name as Maven uh, demo okay so this will and then uh, by default the package will be created like step by step dot Maven demo and we need to click on finish so it will create the project now so we got the Maven demo project so if you extend the project now it will have the by default structure wherein it will be created the Java and step by step and Maven demo packages then pages and then uh, suits so by default uh, I guess it has created this Google home page because as we have selected the template of selenium in test uh, as test in a test ng okay so this uh, uh, these uh, things are already been created by so we can work with this uh, this also and we will modify it uh, somewhere so it has created uh, some uh, uh, sample page factory as well for the Google then it has also created suit so you can like specify the test here so if you observe this is by default created suits are there so this is pretty uh, good to start with and it will have resources folder as well which will have test ng xml so if you see the source it will have the package name and you can specify the test in it so that will be test ng in the resources folder then there will be properties as well it's my artifact and then there will be pom.xml so wherein we need to basically specify whatever we are going to use here so by default it's already been mentioned as we have selected that uh, uh, artifact at selenium so selenium got uh, by default uh, it it is fetching the jar from the maven repository it is also fetching the jar from the test ng uh, for the test ng because we have selected that so there will be by default uh, uh, dependencies mentioned uh, as we have selected that uh, archetype there as test ng 
so if you need any other uh, more jars you can specify the dependencies the dependency can be easily found uh, on the google or, or on the maven repository central repository so that's it for um, setting up maven project in eclipse so if you have any further queries concerns you can drop me an email or you can put it in the comment section i'll be copying over those um, important links where you can re read through what is artifact what is art what is arc type uh, definitions for more understanding in a, a description section